Second World War Diary. Monday, January 1st, 1945. For both Germany and Japan, the outcome of the year 1944 has been catastrophic. Hitler's secret weapons have not had the desired effect, and they are proving inconsequential in the development of the war. On the Western Front, the Luftwaffe commands launch Operation Bodenplatt. Their goal is to attain air superiority in the Battle of the Ardennes and allow the Wehrmacht and Waffen-SS armies to secure their progress. Over a thousand German fighter planes and bombers attack the Allied airfields in Belgium and the southern Netherlands. They manage to destroy 156 Allied aircraft, but their losses are significantly superior. They will represent the last major German air operation. On the Eastern Front, from Klaipeda on the Baltic Sea to Balaton in Hungary, three million German soldiers are facing a six million strong Soviet force. Hitler is aware of the unevenness of the situation. The second and fourth Soviet Ukrainian fronts strike the German Army Group Center in Czechoslovakia. In the area under Nazi occupation are the last industrial assets they control outside of Germany. In Budapest, Hungary, the Red Army takes a train station on the eastern side of the city while the street fighting goes on. In Burma, on the railroad connecting it to Thailand, Allied aviation carries out a raid against the railway center of Nong Pladuk, targeting Japanese oil trains. <laughs> 